Good night, good night. So yo, we have the return of Abby from England. Yes. So Abby, how are you feeling tonight? Tired. Hi, Celeste. Celeste is supposed to be here. You see this coming in the comment section, but in here, y'all, you need to be inside. Yes, yeah, so y'all, tonight we're going to be, dis be discussing some baby mama drama. Right? You know, some ladies, you know, they make things real difficult, you know? It's always something, something always up. Abby, have I had some, have you ever was a dramatic baby mama? No. no. Do you know any? <laughs> Plenty, a little bit. No, just a couple. Just a couple. I don't like to make a lot of things. I will stay away. If you can tell. So. Hmm. So let's say that your condition is that bad. <laughs> Good night, Sonali. Good night, Sonali. All right, Celeste. So, the topic of the hour is baby mama trauma. And tonight we have a little, you know, a small video to take in in case you all, you know, missed it during the week of happenings, you know. They always have something happening in the week that can be very, very interesting. Yes, so. Sonali, do you know any dramatic baby mamas? The ones who like to cause the ones that are confusion? Not really. Not really. Well, that's a, that's a good thing. But no personally or had to endure any of that? No. Right. Very good. Right, because we know that sometimes when it says sometimes it may be with somebody who has children and it just might experience some drama with the baby mamas, you know. It have some ladies who have those experiences. And then of course we know it have those who just love to cause drama. Right? So we will see. We ready for this video. All right, so we are ready for the video yet. So, what is really a baby mama? Look, y'all, every right? day every my book? baby daddy come here with one meal for my child, but I have three other kids. We have one kid together, but he only want to come and bring one thing to McDonald's, but what about my other kids? How come you can't feed my other kids from McDonald's, though? Like, that's bogus as hell like you're not gonna sit here and make my other kids feel left out and you're only bringing one child something to eat look there he go and i bet you he only got one thing in there i bet you he don't even i'm finna expose out of him so people can see how he really is it ain't more than it ain't more than enough food in that bag for everybody what's up because i'm finna expose you what? Because that don't look that don't look enough for all my kids. That don't look enough for all my kids. What is that? That's just one burger, one burger, burger one fry. What he like? What do you mean? Okay, what about my other kids? What about your other kids? Young, that ain't my kids. The, okay, but them your kids' siblings though. What are you talking about? What are you about? Them my kids, them your kids' siblings though. So what you? So he finna, my other kids finna be left out. You didn't feed them. You know I'm 
gonna get my food stamps to the seven. Lisa, how is that my problem? But if you're trying to help out, though, you're I, not I'm helping not, out. I'm not trying to help. I'm trying to help my son. My but child. how are you helping your son when you're only getting care for food for just him and not the other kids, his siblings? Lisa, you have them are his siblings, Lisa, though. He's not finna eat in front of all his other siblings, and they're well, not eating on no McDonald's. Bring no, bring why do I gotta put? Bring him out to the car. I'll let him no, go. no, I'll no. He's not finna eat that shit at all if you can't bring enough for everybody. Lisa, so you telling me that I can't bring my son food? I gotta bring your kids food too now? That's yes. You sound fucking dumb. How is that shit dumb? You That's sound right. dumb. I you sound to. dumb. Where are their daddies at? Nobody told you to talk to mother. You had them other kids. Them, them your responsibility. They're not my responsibility. Okay, but if you're gonna bring one, you need to bring it for all. Lisa, Lisa, How do that Lisa, look that I'm letting Lisa, one Lisa, child Lisa, eat McDonald's and all the rest of the kids can't eat no fucking McDonald's? So you know I get food stamps on the 11th. Three kids that ain't mine. Three kids that ain't mine. Yeah, like? I they're I his siblings. You food. knew what you was getting into when you had a baby with me. No, the I did. Yes, you did. Man, you, you, you expect me to take care of all the kids? They're not my kids. Okay, but you still had a baby with me who have kids Why? with other people. I still have other kids. Because I'm exposing you guys. Everybody think you're such a motherfucking good daddy. No, you're not. No, you're not. You're full of shit in this bullshit. You only come here with one fucking piece of food for one child. The child that's mine, silly. No, that's dumb that you can't feed the other kids. Don't feed nobody at all. Then he can't take that shit. He can't eat it. Maybe if you had one or two, I can, like, you know, maybe. You got it's four, it's three extra kids. What the fuck? You all like go to my mother? Count, spending money on those, all those kids. Them, them, them not my kids. Them are your kids' siblings, though. Dumb. So that's, that's, that's what you gonna go with? That's the one you gonna Those get? are your fing kids' siblings. They must, they're my, they're my, so that means yeah. I can take care of them. So, so don't. Where, no, I didn't say you have to take care of them. You can bring them something to eat if you bring one something to eat. I bring them food every other day. What do you mean? Not... Exactly, but you don't never bring food for the other ones. Please you see. know I get my food stamps on they the 11th. Your babies. Okay, Maybe but I'm not. saying. We share the same kid as well. Absolutely. So if you want to, you if you feel like a feel away about eating, take him in the room and let him. I'm not taking my kid in the room. Or send him down to the car. He ain't even got. He ain't got any point. Brother, he can come right out to the car and eat with me. No, no. You know what? Fine. Give it here. Thank you. Give it here. Give it here. Give it here. Done. He ain't eating this. Fuck you. Why would you just do that? Because you ain't bringing up for all the other kids. You stupid. Stupid. Self is a I, I like you're dumb as hell. Say. You're dumb as hell. He not finna eat that shit. Anyway. Dumb. Take care of him anyway. Dumb. He not finna do that. If you can't do it for all, don't do it for none of them. Good night, Andy. <laughs> so, so that's the saying she's crazy, period. So, Sonali, what are your thoughts? Honestly, I. I got put up on the pettiness and the drama by the start of part two. I have no parents. Honestly, and truly, I can understand where she coming from, and I can understand where he coming from. But honestly, and truly, you don't have to be petty and throw food in the road. But have people who are hungry, and the people who are really concerned about food and them friends, I know that's flipped that burger so many ways. Everybody will get two fries, and everybody will get a shot of whatever drink it was. If it's so concerned about everybody eating something. Um, exactly. At the end of the day, nobody tell you on your back like a turtle and skin up your legs to mm. make all them tricks. So, if you know very well that you can't provide for all of them and you're going with men who can't even take care of the children, honestly and truly. So, well, well, the thing is, I, I couldn't. I was ready to just exit out of that video, like from the startup part. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, the thing 
Yeah, about it is. You know, ladies, when it is you have children, you are responsible for every single one of them. If a man comes, he was with and he is with you, and he's treating everybody differently, that's a whole other story. But if you're not in a relationship anymore, I mean, it's not his responsibility, really and truly, to take care of everybody else. It's not. He's making sure that he sees about his own. And she's saying he's a bad father and he's a deadbeat just because he didn't bring food for everybody, which is wrong. Who knows the child could she could have simply say, Come try to see your daddy, whatever the child name is, come see your daddy. And he could have sat right in the car and eat his McDonald's and if it is he wanted, he could have said, You know what, daddy, I'll go inside and share my meal with my other sibling. You know? Lisa, so did you see the video during the week or anything like that? No. But did you see the video just now? Oh, you didn't get to see the video. Okay, so the whole gist of the video is that this man, he was with this woman, right? So he brought McDonald's for his son. She have three other children that are not his. Right? And then she put him on blast because of it. Throw the food out and all of that. So who do you think is responsible for, you know, all the other children? Should, do you think that the man should have brought food for everybody? Or was he right in just bringing food? Because he did make a point, eh? He did say, you know, maybe if it was just one or two others, maybe he might be able to bring a little extra. But who knows, he maybe have other children. And he have to carry for them. And plus the one that he had with her, so he may not have all that cash. This, that's what he could afford. That's just exactly. what he could have afforded for his but own and that. that. But one thing I find mm-hmm. weird though, she's saying she's on food stamps. From what I know of the states, food stamps is mm-hmm. never late. Never, never late. You get your food stamps either early or you get it literally on time. Food stamps are never late no matter what. So to say right. that she's on food stamps late, that is a whole red flag and a lie right there. You just somebody else must take care of your responsibilities yeah which is completely wrong and for a big woman she just need a good bellows a good couple bellows really and truly yeah definitely because you know something she did a video after right we don't even see that makeup was off just saying i'm not no makeup person but it was real off she had hair done nails done Right, so the money or whatever it is she used to get that done, use that same money to put food on the table for her children. Exactly. Yeah. Lion is saying, keep your dick in your pants. <laughs> you see, Lion, not all not all men would be like you, eh? Not all. Uh, some oh of them can some of them can't. Right, and that's the thing. So, men, when it is getting involved with these ladies, too, just say you have to know what it is doing eh? because, like this situation here, they expect that okay, you get in a relationship with them. Yes, they now kind of here want to be able to treat everybody equally, right? Mm-hmm. However, if it is you have a child with you, you're already planning to stay long. You have to be able to observe, assess the situation. Can I really have a child with this woman? Why did the other men go? Why do you have like three, four different baby daddies? Then it's saying is the wild sex gets your ass in trouble. <laughs> right? And I know she was like, you know what he has gotten into? You know, you met me with all these kids. So I mean what I mean though? What does that mean? And then the thing, you know, it goes both ways too, as well. Same thing for women, you know, women with multiple children. Like, you need to look and observe as well who it is you're having a child for. Like, 
do I want to have a child with this man? Same thing for men will watch and say like, okay, do I really want to have a child with this woman? So it goes both ways. You need to watch who it is you're having children for, really and truly. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You need to. You need to know how, okay, if it is, because some girls, they just might like how a fella look, but can that guy really help you take care of the offspring? You don't want that. It have some people don't mind. All they want, they just know they want a child for this man. They care if the man help take care of the child or anything. They ain't bound to see the child after, right? But on a real, you want the father to be a part of the child's life. You want to know that. Hey, what if it is I like go on today? Something happen. I get snatched out of this world. That the father will be able to help take care of this child. Exactly. That's the thing. Right? So we ladies have to really be knowing what they're doing, guys. You too. If it is you're gonna have a lady who is just trusting you out every moment and expecting you to take care of all her bills, everything. You know? So Lisa, you know anybody who ever was in this kind of situation a man who had you know a woman like that in his life like it's saying some ladies overdoing it yes lisa is voice one there oh, it looks like And it's not the point of the doctor. According to what you want to know, it's not a mix, it's just not a good. You know, it's just not a good. You know? Yeah. You have child, you have child. Okay, you have child. You have child for this. And then she come up with the show, she put it in here. She has been hard to love her, and she has a child in time. Then after how the people to go on and keep on doing their things. So when you look at it, she has tried to try to get men and she went up and do it. And if she has a good children, she wants to get back to go for how good children or boy children, boy children. So they'll be, they'll be the way I come to, you know, I can do it. Um, it's not with me. Yeah, exactly. So like how she said, okay, because she did make that point of, you know, the children know you and, you know, they too going through the transition of, you know, they know you're not wrong anymore, so it's kind of hard on them. So they know about him, then somehow, you know, she's going to go to another man. So now they have to get accustomed with this next man too. And he's saying, I think ladies should also not what they're getting. And I agree with Big Bro. Keep your zip up. Yeah. So yes, Lisa, you're making a point. You say especially when you have your children, like what example are you really setting? You're not sure okay, here's what we're gonna have a I, it's a serious relationship. Sometimes within one year you have three different men rolling through and it's your children are looking at that. Your boy children will not respect you and your girl children will think that it is okay. And when it is they get older and they just like one boy doing like if it is no, 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 no. Yes, a who and all kind of thing. They start calling the girl child just because they don't want the girl child to turn out like you. Right? Or you see in some of the behaviors. But if it is in a certain, the right example, what do you expect? Because some young ladies may not have their head on their shoulders already. They really go into that social, that learning from what it is they see. It just have few young women who may choose to go a different route. Because when, when they really look at life, young people, they just, they learn, they do what they see. They hardly ever, and most of the time it's something negative. It doesn't mean positive things. They just go with the negative vibes and all the negative behaviors instead of choosing to go another path, right? So that's the thing. That's the hard thing. Well, yes. Lion said devil, they more madness. Right, and it have some ladies, yes. 
they have these men with the devil these and they continue having children for them and they know that the man not going to have them take care of these children it have those cases too they go all in over here was i really love this man when it's really the lovely dick right and they keep having children after it's just like it's just easy now no contraceptive no nothing you see them wrong they they living in a fairy tale honestly and truly that's why they say thank god for contraceptive amen but yeah you can understand the devil the devil they can all of that but thank god for contraceptive amen you need to use it exactly and some people just ladies yay you will live in a fairy tale he will be with me once i have a child for him he will stay life will be nice Sure. They're, they're that's a no no. That is a no no. P- ladies, a child does not keep a man. <laughs> it will pick up, make a man run and stay. It's so true, exactly. <laughs> what lion? No dick come today. <laughs> well, yes. Hey. <laughs> oh gosh. Hey. ライブ、ダタックバックエイ。ナタックバックエンジョース。ウェネンウェネンタックバック。ディスゲホクバッツ。イトンジャッサムウェンアイビリーフサムウェンアンサムウェントゥデレヴェナフェリティ。デレ
might believe it, right? And that could cause a lot of trust issues and all in the relationship, mm -hmm. right? But not all men go back with their baby mamas. So ladies, don't think that all men do it, not all men do it, right? Some may for whatever reason, but, you know? But you make her son, and he's saying, son, and as for me, I would have mom. tried to purchase two instead of one. But All some, right. it's not some girls, it's not some baby mothers just don't think. They don't think. Yeah, like, like that lady there. When it is she, 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 she didn't really expose the man because yeah. ready and truly, yeah, especially true. after you train, know? the drink and all of that In away. All right. So now do you see me clean and clear here, and me clean and clear. Yeah. Here? Nice. Lisa, I nice. I know what happened. Yeah, I realize that. Yeah. So, Lisa, you kind of break up a little bit there just now. I think you're saying that how some women they, you know, they come across very literate and ignorant, which is true, right? Because. The thing about it is, if it is you, okay, so like how Sonali say, okay, she understood where the woman was coming from, eh? It's a little loving she wants, <laughs> right? Now she says she's got a little thing in between, you know, <laughs> from this baby daddy, right? So, Sonali was saying, you know, she understand where she was coming from. Now, if it is the man still kind of going and dabbling there, it wouldn't, as Andy said, he would have tried to buy two instead of one, and then they could have share one at the meal half, the next one half, with the other, you know, it's because it's four in total, right? But the thing about it is, if it is the man really isn't in a relationship with you anymore, it's really not his responsibility. But if it is he, he was still in a relationship with her, it would have been... The right, well, what does he would? I don't even want to say the right thing. But it would have been the respectful, loving thing to do to ensure that everyone is fed. Right? I don't know if McDonald's really was the cheapest thing at that point in time. But there are ways around it. No, it have the different come. Mac it would have had something. Be the cheaper. McDonald's is the cheapest thing because you could get off the dollar menu. But you can't, you don't know where the man pocket is. Because like you said, thing. you don't know if he have other children that he have to go and drop off things for. You don't know where the money is. So as, mm -hmm. a, as a grown woman, she could have been yeah. like, and that's as far. Or really and truly send the child out to meet the father and eat elsewhere or exactly. something. Or say, hey, come and pick up your child and carry yeah. them for something to eat. But yeah, call the other, then, call the other daddy. Say, what well, your children? Am I eating or? Whoever, whether it's all the three of them have different daddies, call them, right? Mm -hmm. Now, she's saying the brother wouldn't sit down and eat. Well, if he can't sit down and eat, then everybody don't have to starve because you're upset, right? Or make the little dude that said, don't throw it away because as the saying goes, it have a lot of people out there hungry on the streets mm -hmm. and don't know where their next meal is coming from. She threw that away. It has somebody glad for that, right? But the woman must be hot and need a heat up session. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> she don't want DD. She need DD. So it's not a want, it's a need. Hmm. So Lisa, <laughs> you ever make a tag back? <laughs> so you never make a tag back in the past? Because I was, I was a my, I was a my mom, my mom. I was a very strong mom, not my dad. Right. So, so I didn't had, I didn't have time to put up that now. I finished. Right to right to go to gym after. Right by am, but you take it. So I never had time to put up that now. I ain't going to show them. You do what you do when you're ready, and I realize you go your way, but that's my child. You understand? And so go and right. You already feed back the same thing again, and you know you kind of mind your child. You have to have a talk back, huh? 
husband say them love to talk back right so it really do have some women and they think that here what maybe if it is you know i have two children with him or some women just go as far as lying and saying that they're pregnant right just for the, to see if the man will come ladies please don't do that don't so even do that girl you'll be surprised you will be surprised come on, some of them is gone by the fake girl. Yeah, make the man be the pregnant. It some has some real lifetime element madness going on. <laughs> well, it has some people, I don't know, they have plenty of time on their hands. Some of these ladies have real time on their hands that they come up with different things. Some of them will even go and get pregnant by somebody else and, and tell the man an ex man that is their child and they know very well that it's not the man's child. No, because that when the child is born, right? If that is your child, right? The child has your fingers. The child has like things from the father that the father will notice. You know? Yeah, but well, sometimes born, that does not always be true, eh? Modern world. But we're living in a yeah. modern world. Paternity test. Yes, it's expensive, exactly. but come on, oh God. You can't be so backwards to think it's like 1950s and you just accept it and say, oh, yeah, that is my no, come the man, oh God. Women have to think about that. Like, hey, next thing you know, you really go and take opportunity test or, or the woman you wish when my child, they go, come the man. But they have to think. Them is people who are not thinking beyond. They're just thinking about it now. Yeah. That's what they're thinking about. Thinking about it now, thinking about how they could try and trap the man, all these different things, right? <laughs> Lying again, some ladies don't know what they want. No dick from today. <sighs> so, where does they give any sugar mamas now? Like, exactly. Right? <laughs> no one's now gonna say, like, what you're giving sugar mama? Uh, you just take any sugar from them and know what. <laughs> Hmm. It's so like well, yes. Yeah. Huh. Well, yes. Yeah. That's me, now, lion. You can't do sugar, mama. That's. Yeah, you have to give sugar for the sugar. Uh, what? Eat in the right way. <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, so ladies, please be responsible. You know that you don't want to be in a position where it is you cannot take care of the children of children a child sometimes it can just be one it, it, children having a child is very costly it's not like you know if it's you you could go with the belly empty but they have to make sure that you provide for your child or your children and if it is you know that they're not in the position to do that please try your best try your best not to become pregnant it has so many options. So many options. Right? It has all different. It has pills, it has injections, it has implants, it has it have everything out there that we can think about. Some free, some you pay for. And it will be better for you sometimes to even pay for it. Because they know, right, the inside it will cost you less than if it is a go now to have a child. You understand? This is we are seeing here, girl. Yeah. So. I do this. Oh. Hmm. Right, so you have to be. What's that, Lisa? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh -huh. You're just keeping on yourself. If you want to talk about your young generation, get it, get it. Let me show you. Don't wait till you get it. So, why are you ladies come back? Because of the well. suffering sickle. <laughs> because of the suffering lion. That's the reason why the ladies come back. And because they love the man. That is the reason why they come back. It have other reasons, yes, but you know, most women will come back because of that. That is why they come back. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. When it is you have them in all kind of position, twist up and upside down and all kind of thing. You feel them getting that outside, eh? No. They come in for what they now, what they can get soon by the man. They come in for the hot pot up here now. And they are saying, yes, big brother, the tack back is a trap to all men. Don't fall for the tack back. You know, it has some people that make a tack back and it is work out. Lansing, but you all left and gone. So you all mad. To me, sir, they come up with the pot of pillow. The pot of pillow with the moon, the pieces are being finished. Right, so it has some. Yeah. It has some ladies, they will leave you. Right. 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 Oh, did the woman could cook? You don't know. But it has some ladies. When it is they see the fine, it likes to be like a, a um challenge. You wanna see if they can get him back. You know, and take him away from the girl and let the girl know nah he's he playing like if it is he can't live without me, but he really need me. You just you just um rebound or whatever. It has some girls like that. They leave the man to go with somebody else and then they want to talk back. Right? And Say, now nah, I can get him back anytime I want. I can get here anytime I want. You understand? Nice. So yes. yes. What do you see, be, ladies, think about topic. sex more than men? <laughs> that should be a topic one of these days. Do ladies really think about sex more than men? Yes. Mm-hmm. But honestly, ladies like that who that challenge. Is on those who think like that, I honestly believe it's because their pride and the ego. Really and truly. Yes. They have such mm-hmm. a huge ego and a, such a huge pride that they still believe like nah, I this and I that and you you and me done and you gone with something else that you you see, you know, and the, you see something that you, you miss or something yeah. that you didn't have when it is your was with him. So you're going for that challenge to be like, I could get him back. Yeah. Those type of, um, those type of egos and pride just be nice and hot like a hot air balloon, and then all of a sudden just see please. And it yeah. crashes horrible. And women like that need to stop. They need to stop that. Honestly and true. They do. And he's saying, no, them don't love women. They just love the good D. Yes, so it has some women, all they want is the D. Yeah, all they want is the D. You yeah, understand? There's some women like that, and then there are some women who truly love the men. Huh? Mm-hmm. It has some women who do. Yeah. Then that's why they would they so, stay. They would stay yeah. and they would just fall. Well, and it has some women who really win go with anybody else you might say yeah well we done or whatever but that woman she if it is she really she don't go with anyone else yeah so people don't forget the bus ride is coming up in august right only 200 dollars it's going to be a saturday next weekend we will be releasing the date right so just look out for the gonna be real vibes you're going to see libya Right, so it's gonna be real vibes and niceness, and of course, before the event, we're gonna have some sessions just to make sure everything oil up and tune up because the ride has to be nice. Yeah, in case they lose track for those who wasn't out there, alignment, you know. Like the same no, woman just, should stop to use the children as leverage. Yes, that is so they need true. To stop. That really needs to cover and Women need to stop using children as a pawn for the yes. father and all of that. That nonsense. Mm-hmm. Women forget that sooner or later your children will get bigger. They will have far more sense and they can make their own decisions from there. And women really yes. need Exactly. So women, please stop using the children to play a nasty game. Because they do. And in so many different forms. They will call and say, hey, the child's sick, come now, come across the thing. 
And that time when they reach over now, is all they're trying to do is get you in bed. That time, your child, everything good with your child, you know? One set of lies, one set of game. Right? Oh, you mean the father, lion? This is an ATM until 18. That's. <laughs> I don't, I don't yes. agree with that. having the father just believing that the father is at ATM until 18. Yes, he can, he can, he will do what he could provide for his child, whether he's there, whether he's not, whether all it together or not. But believing that a father is at ATM until 18, it's not just one person who made that child, and it's both of you. Exactly. So, yes, yeah. so don't think that the man have to do it all. Right, both of you all need to contribute towards the upbringing of the child. That is the thing, mm -hmm. right? So, okay. ladies, there are contraceptives out there. Please utilize it. Mm -hmm. Please do. Don't find yourself in a position where it is you have multiple um, children, fathers. Right? Don't find yourself where you're in a situation where it is you cannot take care of the child or the children because sometimes. The father just may pass away, so what are you going to do then? Right? It will be you to really, so you have to make sure that you're in a place where whether the father is there or not, you'll be able to take care of them. Exactly. Men, when they realize these ladies have whoo, plenty of children out there, you make sure you use your condom or do whatever it is they need to do. Right? Because you don't want to be in a position where you have an next one, and then she expecting certain things of you. So know what it is you're getting, is just know what you're getting yourself into. Don't be naive. Don't think, well, you know, everything will be no. Don't do it. Don't think that everything will be all smooth, everything will work out. No, because they don't even know. No who had children, fathers are too, because they are the children, but because you don't know. Next thing, some man coming running up by your doorstep. And you want to know, you know, so all these different things, we have, have to be very, very careful out there. So ladies, utilize the contraceptive methods. It have plenty, well, plenty, right? Make sure I get tested and all the other extra details. Just keep it clean, keep it clear. Mrs. Lion, Lion, stay in there. So no sex for the next five years. <laughs> well, yes. That's wicked. Right? So whatever, whatever decision you all, you know, every, anybody decide to make, whether you want to be celibate, you want to be a virgin again, or however it is you want to do it, just make sure there are things that you can utilize in order to make sure that they're not in no baby mama drama. Yes, so it was nice, people. And maybe we will discuss next time who thinks about sex more, whether it's the man or the woman. Right? What? And he's saying that's why you ladies put us men in court to make us the ATM full time. Well, some men are like going, they don't mind it because it might cost them less. And it has and some it, who did. And it also makes things easier for them too. Yes, you don't have to interact once the money there. You don't have to worry about nothing else. So, for some it's a pro, for some it might, it might be a con, right? And you think next thing, ladies, so the money that the man gives to the child or puts to is for the child. It's not for you to go and do your nails and get the hair done. Please. Right, the money is for Preach. the child, not you. Not you. Just remember that. Buy what the child needs. That's why the father sent the money. Exactly. So, please don't. I'm not let down. He's saying, nah, he said that be that time the man sent any money all the time, but you want to say, nah, he ain't doing nothing for the child, and the man is. Uh, trying his best, working his ass off to help provide for the child and using it to go and look for the next man out there. Don't do it. Okay? So, 
it was nice right and we will search who thinks about sexy mode DJ Marmaxi will have a appetite so it is on Red Bull and it's drinking it is on Red Bull but I went to Magnum